What's up, Cape Bounding Nation? This is video number three in the series. The training camp day two. We're watching some 11 on 11 drills again. Cam Newton in. Long ball. Ooh, just a bit under throw. Good hole by the O-line there. They've been doing a solid job of pushing back that D-line and opening up the draw plays and ISOs for Christian McCaffrey. And C-Mac just runs right through it. Hoping to see some push from the D-line. Nice pass. That was to 15. Looks like a tight end, I assume. There's Dante Jackson on the right side here. Let's see if he makes another play today. That's two pass breakups as of right now. I'm expecting one more while Cam Newton's in though. We'll see. It may or may not happen. Oh. Ooh. Cam is slowly but surely developing that deep ball again. We'll see. A lot of camp days left. A lot of work to be done. But you gotta like the footwork and the mechanics though. Overthrown again. So we're getting back to that overthrowing uh, bad habit that he's had. That's not good. Uh, it's hard to pinpoint what's causing it. I don't know whether it's his shoulder or whether it's his technique. I don't believe it's his footwork, but we'll see. You know, I'll have to relook at the uh, video and see. But as of right now, I think it's his shoulder. We'll see if they say in any interviews this after this camp day whether he had any discomfort or anything. I don't believe he had any, but. I believe that was just technique. But we'll see. We'll see how it shakes out. Now, so far, so good. Everybody's healthy.
Good run. 20 pushing the boundaries on the corner there. This one shapes out. Kyle Allen. Good check down. Yeah, like I said, it's going to be a battle. He and Will Greer have really been grinding it out on passing right now so you say what I think I think Will has the advantage right now Good play. It's hard to tell who got that catch. But if you guys could get a number, that would be great. I wasn't able to. Will looked really good. Before in the 11 on 11s, here he is again. He's starting out. Give him some reps, see how he does. That's uh, 33. Thirty-three on the ISO. <laughs> well, what I'm more interested in is Will's arm. We've seen his handoff. We've seen how quickly he makes decisions. But let's see his arm. Look at that accuracy. That's incredible. I'm trying to think of the uh, quarterback that we let go of that was like third or fourth string a few years ago. He had that type of accuracy. And he was able to keep drive moving. Uh, the problem is he didn't get any playing time or a chance. But it reminds me a lot of him except a lot quicker and that's a very very good thing but it can be a bad thing as well as I mentioned before in previous videos uh, yeah, I have seen quick decision making turn into picks so you have to be careful uh, on that quick turn and release but Yeah, Cam's back in. All the starters are back in. Let's see how this shakes out. Oh! That's another overthrow. Again, could be discomfort, could be mechanics. 
We won't know till the interviews. That doesn't thrill me too much to see him overthrow a screen pass, though. So. There we go. That was a much better pass. That's kind of along the lines of what you're looking for. Three going back. Final set of 11 on 11s for this camp practice today. Good run, C Mac. Good run. Check down. I will say this for Cam, he was making very good decisions. Um, the concern again is his overthrows. I mean, once he gets those cleaned up, I think he should be fine. So here's Kyle Owen. He's getting his reps now. Good stop by the D1. 
that's what I was discussing earlier, you know, when I said that I was hoping that the D1 would stiffen up and get that run and stop. And, uh, you know, grind on the line. They've been allowing a lot of easy runs, ISOs and draws. So, to see that every once in a while is very encouraging. Nice. 20 on the catch. Yeah, the thing is, we've seen Kyle Allen. We all know what he's capable of, what he can do. Uh, what I'm more interested in is Will Greer. I'd like to see him get a few more reps. Uh, ooh. Oh! What a throw! I'm not sure if I got that properly on camera, but what a throw by Kyle Allen. Nice run. Up with the line, open that hole there. Uh, Again, you like to see the defensive line stiffen up a little bit. You try to stop that. Uh, there was the same concern in day one as well. Where they weren't bucking up and plugging up those gaps. Here's that fourth ring quarterback. Now fourth string. Was third string last year. So we're getting a few last minute looks at him. This camp winds down here for day two. Nice speed. You know, that's always been his staple is his speed. And while that's good, you like to see him try to make those passes, not force them. You know, on uh, certain situations, certain plays. But, uh, That is the end of day two of camp. I'll be doing a wrap up video uh, to finish this out. If you liked what you saw, hit that like button, hit that follow button, subscribe, and uh, hit that bell if you're not done so already. Let you know when I'm going live and putting up new content. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you guys next time. And always remember, keep pounding. Peace, guys.